Hey my friends, how's it going? It's Ultimus, and today, as per usual, at least as I attempt to, we have more 2v2 arenas for you. Not really sure why I'm doing these, and what I mean by that is I'm fully geared, um, other than the fact that I just want to play. I've had such an itch to just arena and keep arenaing and do as much as I can, just for fun recently, so I've been just trying to queue into games. Love openers like that, no charge, but caught them both off guard. As you can see, I pulled them both out of stealth, and they kind of stood there for a second. I'm playing with super low latency too, which kind of sucks right now, but as you can see, the burst that was going into that hunter was just relentless. And I don't know if my lag was throwing him off or what. Uh, unfortunately, my hunter friend decided to go down there. There's nothing much he could do about it. He was undergeared. I told him I didn't care if he was geared or not. I just wanted to play. I just wanted to play games. So, feeling very confident about this. I started off this 1v1 at full health. Dipping down pretty quickly, more or less. Um, but I've still got some good defensives to use. Out of the couple that warriors have, at least. I was able to nail that uh, stun there. So, waited until the disengage was gone. I'm sorry, the deterrence was gone. There's the second deterrence, the disengage. And at this point, it's just the chase game. There's the heroic leap to get around that. And I'm trying to catch up as best as I can. Wanting to look out for traps, not get caught on them. He's going to disengage there, or sorry, um, I keep saying disengage. Pretty sure he's using the good old feign death to uh, re-stealth trick there that you get for the camouflage for hunters. Which is a pretty clever trick, I'm not going to lie. Got caught in that binding, unfortunately. So at this point, he's just playing the kite game. Had that storm bolt for him, though. There's the charge going in. The crits are just too much, and there's not much you can really do about it once you dip down to that 20% range. Anyways... At this point, things weren't going so well. My latency was actually causing me more trouble than the comp was because Hunter and Warrior does work pretty well together. So I ended up having to try to fix my latency, and by that point, my random partner was gone. So I picked up a Rep Paladin here from Trade Chat. Now, normally I don't play with Rep Paladins, not because Rep Paladins are necessarily terrible. Um, I just find that they're just as comp dependent as Warriors are, and since they don't really synergize well together, uh, I tend to avoid. So the target was Boomy. However, if you'll watch over there, my paladin is laying into that hunter. I'm not sure what the hunter decided he wasn't going to do, but one hodge, and then he went from 25% health to dead. So at this point, I'm trying to just stay alive against the Boomy, understanding that the Boomy has every advantage over me as a warrior, so I'm just trying to use my defensive wisely until my ret can get back onto the druid with me. Still wanted to play smart, because if the druid is good enough, he can still win the game, but at this point, it's just not going to be the case for him. That last stone bolt there to secure the kill, and there it goes. Last match of this video, too good not to share. Even if I didn't make videos every day, I probably would have made a video of this match just in general. Check this match out. So there's already a lot of bursts coming from myself and the uh, Rep Paladin that I'm playing with. Enhancement Shamans aren't exactly anything to scoff at either, so they have some good bursts and decent control. Priest is squishy as butts, though. So watch what we do to this priest. It is utterly glorious. He gets caught over here in that stun. There's the uh, charge. Already half of his health gone. There's cooldowns. Colossus smash. Boom. There's just nothing he can do about it, and it's beautiful. I feel so very, very bad. But, oh, when you get matches like that, it is so hilariously wonderful. Because, let's be real, everybody knows what it's like to be on the receiving end of those. And sometimes it's fun just to be able to dish it back out so it helps kind of balance out the universe or something. I don't know. But anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this match. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. I have more videos coming for you very, very soon. And as always, I'll catch you next time.